think, you know, there's so many areas of our life that we don't realize how much more we have in the tank, how much more that we're capable of, what our potential, where our potential truly ends. And I think the, the most interesting part was when I quit, when I stopped, like when I finished, that was when the pain set in. You know, I've recently become aware of the fact that I'm addicted to progress. And I really think that progress is where happiness and fulfillment ultimately come from. And challenges are what create the opportunity for the growth that's required for that progress to take place. And so we know that challenges are gonna happen naturally. But there's gonna be challenges, obstacles, things that pop up and we have to overcome. But I like this, this idea of having daily, weekly challenges that you're proactively pursuing because it gives you the opportunity to step into that space of progress, to step in the space of being able to grow and overcome and you know accomplish those, those things that you're that week, that day going after, and ultimately becoming the best version of yourself on a daily or weekly basis, which is, which is awesome. It's all about progress. It's such an important message for people to hear is, yeah. is progress because, especially someone that's just starting off in a career, sure. is figuring out that any progress is progress. Yes. And if you become obsessed with that, then it's really just about basically living up to your full potential. Like, yeah. how can I create my full potential? And once it's I feel like I'm getting... Fear, right? Well, yeah, exactly, that's exactly what I was about to say. And once you feel like you're getting somewhere close, realizing that it's actually way, way further down the road. Yeah. Uh, and I think a part of uh, realizing your full potential is the, the reality that every single day there is no neutral. Sure. So I think a lot of people fear ultimately realizing what their full potential is, as in like reaching it. As much as we all say we want, like that's our goal is to reach our full potential, I think there's a little bit of fear in realizing, oh, that's, that's, that was my potential. What I've found in these challenges and seeking discomfort is every single time you possibly, you put every ounce of your soul, soul into something, to reach your full potential, you realize it just gets scooted out a little bit further and it grows a little bit further out. And that, that fear that's holding you back from trying to reach that potential is what's holding you back from that potential being so much more than you could ever fathom in your mind. Maybe the pain that you're feeling right now is coming from you always stopping short. And maybe if you just kept moving, if you just kept pushing forward, then that pain would go away. Because it wasn't until I stopped. Like I was feeling great when I ran, but the second that I stopped, the second that I sat down, the, set up, the second that it began to rest was when the pain set in. So if that's you, if that's someone that's experiencing pain right now, then what is it in your life? What area in your life do you need to keep moving forward for that pain to subside? Keep moving forward for that pain to go away.